Parte dos. Okay. Let's see if they'll take a picture. Picture. Okay. Tres dollars. Three bucks. What is this? Come here. What is this? Okay. Okay, is this so ho ho ho? Well, it's a starfish and it's caught up in somebody's stuff. I think the starfish goes on this safety pin, which somebody told me was a friendship thing. But I don't think this... What? Okay. You know what I'm saying. Okay, this green one doesn't belong on here. This belongs over here. What is this? Okay, somebody tell me. Okay. <laughs> maybe. Maybe, maybe. Maybe, baby. I don't know. <laughs> ah, I don't know, guys. This is the weirdest thing I've ever seen in my life. Somebody kind of put stuff together and... Okay. Put that in there, this in there. I don't know about this. Um... If y'all want this, it'll be three dollars just because there's this big starfish, a ceramic bead, these things, and all this chain. But I don't know how it works. Maybe just one for parts. I don't know. <laughs> that was weird. Okay, let me see this. I think this is a pretty. Let me see. Looking for a closure. That's cute. Oh, here we go. A.E. So I think this is American Eagle uh, from way back. A way back machine. A.E. Has a little heart. And a little heart with a lock. That is so cool. An extender with a bead. Lobster cut clasp. This is gunmetal. And look at all these little hearts. On their locks. like a, And then green um, faceted uh, seed beads. It's on a Figaro style chain. Oh, that's so cute. It's like minimalist. It's the it's very cute. It's all green beads and then little hearts that are locks. It's a long chain. It's like oh about twenty eight inches, I think. This is really cute. Where is it? Okay, here's the back. So here you go. What do you see? It's so cute. Take a picture. La la la. Oh, this would be three dollars. <laughs> Necklace department. Unbelievable. They're gonna take something ugly like they always do. Okay, this is a brooch. This goes over here for later. Well, that was heavy. <laughs> These are seed bead necklace, but I think it's just seed beads. It's copper color. Maybe a dollar in the necklace department. I don't know why that tipped over. Knock it off over there, you guys. Um, let me see this mess right here. Holy mackerel. Look at this. This is the back? Yes, I don't know. Holy moly. Yeah. Unbelievable. Okay, there's a chain in there. Oh. Oh. Okay, are you? What are you? Mm-hmm.
This one looks interesting. With a K. It's an initial necklace. And it has a spade. Oh, like Kate Spade? Mm hmm. Is that her mark, Kate Spade? Is a spade, like a spade and club and, uh, like, you know, like I'm playing cards? Because I don't know. I bought my granddaughter a tote from Kate Spade. What is this? There's a K. Well, that's backwards. K. Looked like it was gold tone at one time. This chain is really fine. Hmm. And there's a little um, rhinestone at the bottom of the uh, extender. Huh. I don't know. Okay. Back to this beaded thing. Holy smokes. This has to be the back of your neck, okay? Then interwoven in the hair are beads, really pretty beads. Gr olive green, dark green, all kind of different, like peacock colors. Look at that. With all these other sea beads. This thing is heavy. Look at all these beads. Holy mackerel. And then this in the bottom is like in a mess. It's like it's supposed to be messy at the bottom. Look at all these beads interwoven in there. It's crazy. It'll be five bucks. Wow. People do so much work. Holy smokes. Arabian Claw. What is that? It looks like it's brand new. This is thread wrapped around something. This is leather. Yeah, this is a wrap bracelet. Hmm? It's a wrap bracelet. Hmm. Very interesting. Find some interesting stuff in here. Trademark Ravenclaw, huh? Okay, Ravenclaw. Okay, this is a this is Ravenclaw wrap lace that is five bucks. Oh, this is a cute ring. It's a um, my phone is not on silent. I'm gonna smash it. A ring going in here. I showed it. You going on? No, that's my nurse. Hold on. Okey. Doki. Sweetheart. She's a doll. Okay. Well, that's good. I heard her message anyway. Okay. These are wood beads, except for... These are acrylic beads, but most of them are... They even finish. See? Look. Ah, ha, ha. Love it. These are acrylic with mostly wood beads finished on both ends. Memory wire bracelet. It'll be $3. I wonder how long it takes to make a round bead out of a piece of wood. Hmm? The artisans just they this is a this is a memory wire with leather, okay, and has end caps on it and it's driving me crazy, so it'll be a dollar in the necklace department. <laughs> so I can get it off here. Yeah. 
Okay. Yeah, the artisans that make these beads by hand are just something else. This is Limited Express. Hmm. I think this box has more names on, on it than any other box I've had. It has a big lobster claw clasp. It's all gunmetal clasp with an extender and a bead. And there is one big chain with texture on it. There's little texture things like a loose rope. And there's another loose rope and then one rollo chain. So there's three chains and it's just there. Look, YouTube. <laughs> It'd be two dollars in the necklace department. And this is another leather bracelet. Uh oh. Does it work? Yep, it works. I think so. Let's see. It worked one way. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it works. And it's braided. Can you see that? It's braided. It's leather. All these leather bracelets are four or five dollars. It'll be four dollars. It has a little wear right there. These are. This is like a giant bee ball chain. Has a lobster claw clasp and has a name on it? No way. Premier Designs. Check it out. Get out of here. Someone's playing a trick on me. Can you see it? There he is. Yeah, there. Yeah, this is a, a giant bee ball chain. It's heavy. It's nice. Has a rosy tint to it, the lobster claw clasp. It's nice. Nicely made. Maybe three dollars. Mm, this is real. What does this tag say? Made exclusively for Park Lane in my ugh. Jewels by Park Lane. Hmm. Yeah, well, these are not gemstones. No. This is uh, acrylic. They look, They did a good job. They did a good job of making the chip necklace. Where if I could find a... I can't find a clasp. This is not um, cold at all. None of the beads are. None of the chips are. And there's no clasp on this. No. Yeah, from from looking at it, it you'd think it was amethyst and no fluorite and all kinds of stuff. But it's not. It's just pretty. Be three dollars. New with tag. Yes, that was really be heavy and cold. Oh, this is nice. What is this? It's just a mesh chain, I think. I think that's what it's called. I love these end caps right here. There is an extender with a bead on it, lobster claw clasp, silver tone. I don't know about this. Why it has yellow on it? It might have been a gold wash. Something, some mesh uh, chain. Hmm. Maybe two dollars. Okay. Okay. Hair barrettes. <laughs> and what is this? This is a pin, like from. Wow, this is really old. Holy smokes. Look at this C-class. Golly. We'll discuss that later. 
Hope we get more uh, earrings. This is something else. It looks like a hook, like a fish hook, but it's made of wood and it's sharp right there. And they wrap the twine or whatever this is around it. Look at it, braided it. Look at that. And then made a necklace with wood to close it. Unbelievable. This is this bag, this box is something else. Look at that. Somebody stained it, polished it. <laughs> and you can hurt yourself on that. Holy mackerel. This is so cool. Uh, this is $5. That is um, unbelievable. Artisan work. Look at this one. This looks old too. But I don't know. Might be made to look old because this is Rachel. Yeah, right there. R A C H E L. Big lobster clock clasp. This is copper looking. Looking, not copper. These are cool right here. This filigree beads. And then there's acrylic beads that are faceted, and then faux pearls, and then these beads again. And it comes down to this bow that is the bomb. Look at that. It's kind of a meshy bow with a tassel on the bottom. This is really pretty. Holy smokes. That'd be $4 also. Wow. What a trip. This is something else. Okay, Arkansas, huh? Ew, this is like butter. Look at these. This is brand new. These end caps and the lobster clock class. It's bright, bright, bright white metal. Wow. Holy smokes. These are right here are like butter. They're braided. I don't know if you can see the braid, but it's unbelievable. The work. And this is tied here. There's three pieces of metal, a gold tone, so white tone and silver tone. Look at that. This is unbelievable. And there's no maker on this one. Wow. Oh, it moves too. This is unreal. This stuff is so soft. You gotta feel it. It feels like the nicest purse you ever felt. Like a Ferragamo. This would be five dollars also. Holy smokes. I'm really impressed with the artisan work in this bag. Bat box. You know, you see mass produced stuff and then you see items like that. It's like, wow. See if I can get this on out of here. This is also the name on it. I'm shocked. Okay, so this is a leaf. It's a toga style clasp. It's at the bottom. Uh, it's part of the design, actually. But let me see who this is. Cookie Lee. Oh, gunmetal. And here's the closure, but it's part of the f design in the front. And it goes around your neck like this. And it has texture on one part of the chain. This is smooth, this has texture. That's pretty. Really nice. All the rhinestones are there. $4. Okay, okay, this belt now is now going to jerk everything out of there. <laughs> this is a belt. It's stretchy, not too much, but this is a little portion. The clasp is right here. You can see that right there. It has a heart on it. 
what year did these come out? I don't know. I was working. I don't remember. This will be a dollar. And then I'm going to put it in necklaces because we don't have a belt department. All right. All these pretties. These are pretty pretties. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Number two. There's this thing again. Osiris thingy. I wonder what this is. It's a necklace. There's a lobster claw clasp. It's on a cable chain. And it's that thing again. You don't know what that thing is? And this is gold tone. And this is silver tone. This is... A dollar. Huh. I'm gonna get this on the table because oh, I see. It's pretty. Yeah, almost the the all the beads have A B on them. Mm. Pretty pretty. I'm impressed with this box. I never get bags. I think I got the bag twice. The rest is just all dumped in a box. And I'm just so shocked that anything survives. The Pony Express, the throwing around at this facility. I mean, really. I'm really shocked. Okay, why is this? Okay, this is a pretty necklace. It's stuck on this thing. Oh no. What in the world? Y'all, this is weird. It's another one of these weird things. There's a beatball chain stuck in this metal flower. You know what I haven't seen in a while is those beautiful metal roses. I'm obsessed with them. And I haven't seen any lately. They're usually red roses, um, just one. And they're so pretty. Okay, can I get this one done yet? Nah. Almost. Sorry, guys. This is a nasty tangle right here. This is what happens when you got little bitty chains in here. And then after I get this done, then I'm going to cut it because we're coming up on the two, the two video cutoff. And I'll do it. I'll probably end up doing it again like yesterday. Okay, this is one of these things. I don't know what these are called, but they're little bars, but they're circle, half circles. Has a lobster claw clasp with an extender and a bead on it. They're red acrylic beads. They're really pretty. It's a nice dainty necklace. It'll be a dollar. Okay. Okay. I'm going to save this for tomorrow because it's gnarled up in this coin thing or whatever this is. Mm okay. I don't know what this is. The Republic of what? I don't know. But I have to get that under. Okay. Uh thank you for joining me tonight. I love you guys and um yeah. Don't forget, whoever this was that ordered this beautiful necklace, the Dan Berry Mint uh, Rubelite and Grape Garnet necklace, please let me know. I'll get it off to you. Just send me an email um, so I can know which bucket to put it in, all right? I really don't want it to hurt, get hurt. And um, thank you for uh, being patient. 
trying to split my time between keeping my oops, keeping my legs up and fulfilling orders has been tough. And so I'm just having to fulfill orders because I want to get caught up. I feel embarrassed that I'm not caught up. Um, but it's just me. I was supposed to get some help, but that never arrived. So I'll just do the best I can, you know? And I know you guys understand. You're here. I'm here. And we all love each other. And... It's all cool. And I love you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. And please put your thumbs up for me. Share and subscribe. It's very important so I can get more goodies for us. I love y'all. Ciao for now. I'll see you in the next one. Good night.